Now, another area where Britain lags behind America is in our claim culture. In Missouri, a woman's family have been awarded $74 million after she claimed she contracted cancer from talcum powder. Mind you, I once shat in my own pants to get out of PE, so who am I to judge? Anyway, Bobby Mayer has been investigating the rise of claim culture in the UK. Have you ever been mildly inconvenienced by a minor injury that was probably your fault? Are you prepared to exaggerate those injuries in return for a cash settlement? Fuck yeah! A woman is fighting for 4.2 million pounds after falling over and fracturing her wrist in a pub beer garden. 4.2 million! It wasn't a monkey ripping her face off, it was a broken wrist! Carmen Mazza has already been awarded 156 grand, but is now suing for damages to her mental health because she claims that the scars on her arm make people think she's a self-harmer. Who gives a shit? Has she even seen a self-harmer's arm? It's just a bunch of silly little scratches, the attention-seeking pussies. I can't blame her for trying, though. I'd be happy with 150 grand. So I went to a beer garden hoping to set up a personal injury claim of my own, but ended up handing it to this lucky fucker. These are litigious times we live in, and our children need to understand the world they're entering into. And as a result of Goldilocks burning her mouth on the porridge, which was too hot, and bruising her coccyx on the faulty chair, she successfully sued the three bears for everything they had even though she had illegally entered their home. For 4.2 million, I'd ram a pencil into my brain. I went to the public to see what they'd do. For 4.2 million pounds, would you let me tweeze every hair out of your body? Yes. Really? Yeah, for 4.2 million? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Definitely, actually. I'd let you probably do a bit more than that for 4.2 fucking million. For 4.2 million pounds, would you put my beard in your mouth? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. It's kind of PB. I don't know. I don't know. We're from Holland, eh? Yeah. First you, first Hey, then we will do it. <laughs> then we'll do it. I've been to Holland. That is how it works. Yeah. For 4.2 million pounds, would you have your eyeballs removed and replaced with toes? Ooh, um, no. Definitely not. No. No. I'm gonna draw the line there, no. Probably, n yeah, you know what, yeah. You should see my toes though, they're really, really nice. You don't even have to have something bad happen to you to claim compensation. Just witnessing something awful is enough to get a payout. Yeah, all right, this is pretty horrible, but look on the bright side. We're all gonna get a new kitchen out of this. The compensation culture has pushed up insurance costs raised tax bills, and restricted access to the legal system for many more deserving people. But there'll always be chancers like Carmen Mazzo. Like the average payout of the loss of a testicle is 13,000 pounds. She's going for 4.2 million. That's 323 balls. And she can lick each and every one of them.